this is an example really of a scientist applying himself uh, driven by basic research but picking up on a discovery and taking it through as much himself as working with other people. He dedicated many years to show that this method was applicable for many other things. Um, the first step in a transplant is, is blood typing. The donor and the recipient have by and large to have compatible blood groups. It was possible to recognise them before by mixing blood, two types of blood together and looking at the reaction between the two and that was dependent on having a set of typing reagents um, which were by and large bled from human beings. And now with monoclonal antibodies it's possible uh, to be independent of bleeding human beings to get the same mixture each time you perform the test and to get very consistent results. Well, I think that he foresaw not only the impact on diagnosis but also on therapeutics. Uh, he supported a number of people who came to his lab um, who wanted to produce antibodies for giving to people for therapeutic purposes. I think that he would have stressed the importance that basic research has for anything, really. People should work on what they think they can solve and what they think it is important, but what it is basic research, that the fruits will come afterwards.